this case consider the issue of nuisance, and whether or not a man owed a duty of care to his neighbour to prevent the spread of fire when a tree on his property had been struck by lightning. In this case, a lightning bolt had struck a tree on a man's property. The man then took steps to wet the surrounding area with water so the fire would not spread immediately, and then chopped the tree down and allowed the tree to continue to burn. However, two days later, on a hot and windy day, the fire escaped from the smouldering remains of the tree and ended up causing a fire that damaged the neighbour's property. The neighbour brought an action against the man in nuisance. The man argued that he was not liable for an act of God and that his method of cutting the tree down and letting the tree burn itself out was an acceptable way of reducing the risk of the fire spreading. The court rejected